So again, sales tax is money that is added to anything that you buy. The income tax is money that they take out of your paycheck. Sales tax is money that they add to anything that you buy. Income tax is money that they take out of your paycheck or your salary. Okay, so I found this game and I put the link on here because I wanted you to be able to see um, how to practice problem, bless you. And be able to kind of practice these if you were having trouble with it. Like if you were to go home tonight and not really know what's going on, you could reference back to this. Okay, so sales tax means that we're going to add money to what we're doing. Income tax means we're gonna take money away. So I want you to write that down too if you need to. Sales tax means we're adding money to our bill. Income tax means that we're taking money away from our salary. Either way though, you are losing money when it comes to taxes. You're losing money based on sales taxes because they're charging you more, and you're losing money on income taxes because they're taking money away from you. All right, so here's our first question. It says, what is the sales tax for a purchase of $20 if the tax rate is 10%? What is the sales tax for a purchase of $20 if the tax rate is 10%? What is the sales tax for a purchase of $20 if the tax rate is 10%? Now, I don't need you to just have an answer for me. If you can, great. I love that you're able to think about that. But let's talk about this for just a second. I want you to write this into your journal. Part over whole equals percent over 100. Part over whole equals percent over 100. Part over whole equals percent over 100. Okay, so let me ask you this. If I were to fill this proportion out, do we agree that 100% is the total cost that I'm paying? So 100% is gonna be the $20. 100% is going to be the $20. We okay with that? And how much percent tax are they charging me? Well, 10%. 10%. And do I know what 10%, I know a lot of you can do it in your head, but at this moment, do we know what 10% of 20 is? Yeah. We don't. So we're gonna put an X here as our unknown. Okay, guys, you set up a proportion. From here, we just cross multiply and divide. Does that work? Yeah. All right, so let's just do this one quick. 20 times 10 is 200, which is equal to 100X. You guys okay with that? Now I'm gonna divide both sides by 100. And I find that two is equal to X. Now we're talking about sales tax here. So am I going to subtract this number or add this number? Uh, Kendall, what do you think? We're gonna subtract this number or add this number? Add it, right? Because when you go to the store, do they subtract your tax away? They add your tax to it. So my total price is gonna be $22. Now if we check it out. Incorrect. Oh, they didn't want to know the total, they just wanted to know what was the tax rate. You guys see a difference there? Yeah. So we took 22 because that was the total. All it was asking for was just the actual tax amount. So that's on me, that's my bad. All right, let's try another one. This one's for you. What is the sales tax for a purchase of 450 if the tax rate is 6%? So I'm gonna help you set it up. You're gonna help me set it up. Let me rephrase that. We're gonna keep our same proportion. Part over whole equals percent over 100. What's my total price I'm paying right now? 400. 450, thank you, sir. Our whole price is 450. What's our percentage going to be? The tax percent is 6%, and percent is always out of 100. So then what do I put up here? X, good. Now how would you solve this one? Isaac? Cross, cross multiply and divide. Okay, do it. Why don't you cross multiply and divide? I'll do it, you do it, we'll check our answers. Please do it though, don't just sell yourself short and do nothing.
Okay, so here's what I got out of this. The tax for that is going to be $27. Now, if I wanted to find the total price, what would I do with that $27? Add it to what? The $450. $450. Good. Now, let's just check our math to make sure that I haven't lost my mind. There we go. Okay, so we feel pretty good about sales tax. Yes. All right, I'm going to go back to our PowerPoint then. So on the next slide, we're going to talk about income tax here. And I'm going to go full screen again with this one. Now, income tax is a little bit different. Income tax is a little bit different. And I actually think what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop here and I'm going to pick up with income tax tomorrow. I think income tax can get a little bit confusing, so I don't want to overload you. So what I'm going to do is, on your homework tonight, you're just going to have sales tax. I'm going to delete that second paper. Online, can you hear me say that? We're not going to just totally erase it, but I want to move past income tax and have more time to talk about it, okay? So we'll resume with income tax tomorrow. I'm going to end with sales tax. So give me a second. I'm going to go edit out Canvas. I'm going to get the income tax part out of it, and we're just going to focus on sales tax today, okay? So go ahead and put your homework up, and then we'll talk about it.